Hi everyone and a very warm welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I'm coming to you with the first video of a One Piece Five Ways series. I'll be taking a staple piece in your wardrobe and show you five ways you can wear it for different occasions. And today's video is five ways to style this blazer that I'm wearing here. This is a brown houndstooth print blazer from Zara a couple of years ago. This is one of my favorite blazers for winter since it has a good percentage of wool in its composition. However, I think you could take these principles and apply them to a lot of different kinds of blazers in different colors, shapes, etc. It's quite a general blazers video and I'm going to show you different ways to wear from casual to a little bit more dress up Friday night kind of outfits, casual weekends, to workwear, etc. So, let us begin with the outfit. Starting with workwear, in which blazers are a great staple piece. I've paired it here with my black cigarette trousers from Zara, this season, still available. And even if it's not a suit, I think this oversized blazer works really well with any type of trousers. Everything will be linked below, where possible, since some pieces are old. However, alternatives will be linked down below. In this outfit, I just kept it nice and simple. You could opt for a lighter color jumper, maybe wearing a t-shirt and layer a cardigan underneath, a high roll neck in brown matching the blazer or in beige would also be good alternatives. There are different ways to adapt this outfit, depending on the weather where you live. As for the footwear, I've gone for these black ankle boots because they feel quite smart but also comfortable and easy to walk. And finished with this amazing bag from Mango. It is not real leather, but at the moment I needed a work bag and didn't want to blow the budget. Anyway, I think it's quite smart and acceptable quality. For the second look, I opted for a smart casual look. In order to maximize your blazer wear, style it with your casual pieces. For me, if I wear an all casual look, I feel a little bit too undone. Whereas, if I style those pieces with a blazer, it instantly feels a little bit more intentional and put together. So, what I've done here is gone for a monochromatic head-to-toe set that matches the blazer and I think that is another style tip for casual outfits. If you want to feel a little bit more put together, wearing something in the same color, head to toe, or in the same tones, within the same color, really elevates the look and make it feel a little bit smarter. So, here I've gone for this set of joggers and hoodie in this taupey brown beautiful shade, this set is new from Zara. I love these really easy to wear sets that I reach to every time I need to be running errands. They're comfortable and casual, but by heading this blazer, the outfit looks like you've made a little bit more of an effort. Don't be afraid to mix and match your shades to create tonal looks because they work really well and then the blazer over the top, like I say, just gives it a little uh, bit of a structure. And I finished my look with this casual, relaxed crossbody bag in beige. Also, I opted for white sneakers, but you could as well opt for a kind of a hug boot. The third outfit is a daytime chic look. So, this next outfit is the perfect smart chic slightly more daytime look. And there's a bonus here, because in this category I'm going to show you two different outfits. In the first one, I've gone for a pair of brown leather leggings and a longer satin blue shirt. This one is old from Zara. However, you can easily find some similar in stores. I think if you are going to wear skinnier trousers like this, then it's good to go for something a little bit more oversized on top to keep that look balanced out. Then I paired it with a blazer, of course, and my dark brown bag 
to match the brown knee-high boots. I think these boots look perfect over the leather leggings. This look is a perfect one to take you from day to night. It would work really well and I think this is a look that would tick a lot of boxes for a lot of different occasions. In the second look, I'm styling my blazer with a satin midi skirt. You can go with any kind of top you like. I chose a chunky jumper with this work knitwear and the same brown knee-high boots. I finished off with the matching bag I already talked to. And I love the texture here of the satin skirt then combine it with the jumper and this brown wool blazer. I think it feels really rich, sumptuous and wintry feeling. Now let's adapt this blazer to an evening look. And here's how I would style the blazer to do an evening appropriate look. I'm wearing it with this black leather mini skirt from H&M. And I'm personally a real fan of wearing mini skirts or shorts with a slightly more boxy oversized uh, blazer, especially for evening. I just think it looks really chic and works really well. I've paired this black mini skirt with some fine denier tights. I think these ones are from Calcedonia. They're always a bit of a fail safe. And then these burgundy boots from Mango. The burgundy with the brown of the blazer. It's a perfect combo in my opinion. I chose this brown top with these puffed sheer big sleeves. It's quite important to wear the longer heeled boot because otherwise there would be a lot going on at the top and nothing to balance it out at the bottom. The taller boots help to ratify and balance the boxier blazer. So, if you stuck with me until now, it would be a great time to ask you if you could hit that subscribe button. It would be very much appreciated and thanks for joining me on to the final look. That is the weekend look. I wanted to do a kind of what I would call a weekend look. Something quite comfy, traditional but still elegant. A look that, if you're going out for lunch or something, you still look quite put together. And so, I'm wearing this 100% wool jumper I already showed you on previous videos, and then style it with this matching 100% wool scarf from Zara. But I think any kind of scarf bundled up with the blazer is a really nice look, because You've got the structure of the blazer and then the warmth and casualness of the scarf against that. And I think it really works well. And then just these dark grey denim jeans. And for footwear, I opted for my black over the knee boots also hold in my closet. 
I love the long low heel over the knee boots with a slightly skinnier leg. I think it really works well. And that's all for today. I hope you enjoyed the looks and that this video has given you some inspiration to really utilize any blazer that you have in your wardrobe. Don't forget, hit that subscribe button. We are on the way to 300 subscribers, which is just insane to me, since I have just started last October. So, thank you, thank you so much for following along and subscribing. I really, really appreciate it. Tomorrow, I'll be sharing one very exciting ultimate guide video. So make sure you join me for that. Bye!